I was always really drawn to the sciences and I was a, a very strong water person. And as soon as I learned how to scuba dive, I, I just realized that there's this whole world underwater that, you know, relative to the amount of people that work on land and study forests or birds or things like that, there's a lot fewer people that work underwater and study um, the worlds under the surface of the ocean. And not only that, there are many impacts that are happening to the oceans that people may not see or may not realize. Um, the oceans are so big, they cover over 70% of the planet's surface. And for so many years, people use them as kind of a, a way to, oh, we'll just dump this garbage or this pollution out in the ocean and it'll just dilute and it'll go away and, you know, out of sight, out of mind. If uh, the ocean's so big that dilution is the solution to pollution was, uh, you know, a motto for so many years. Um, well, now we've gotten to a point where the oceans can't absorb any more of this damage and pollution that we've done to them. And so there's a strong need for scientists to be studying all aspects of what's happening in the ocean in order for us to, you know, know what the state, the health of the oceans are, and then to try to reverse some of the damage that we've done for generations 